Hello folks and welcome to the Vertigo Tea Party and let's play Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition on the PC. Go ahead and get started. Eh, uh, sure, that's fine for brightness. Whatever. 93 by 1080, yes! Yes! I've got my controller set up, so... In our character name, I shall do so. Malachi, that's my name. Don't wear it out, it's actually not my real name. Okie dokie. There we go. Uh, of course, this doesn't matter, like, at all. Um, now, again, just to... Uh, I'll go into this a bit more. I, not playing this blind, I've seen a lot of Let's Plays, but I'm still a little hazy on a lot of things. Um... I kind of like the thief. I think the thief sounds pretty good. What, who has the most endurance? Uh, Bandit has a lot. I do like some endurance. Oh boy. Eh. Let's go over the thief. Uh, I don't know how much it really matters. I don't think it does. Uh, and I've already got the master key as my gift. So I guess... I'll get this ring, the tiny being ring, which apparently is not even labeled correctly, even after all these years. Uh, I think it just increases your max hit points by some, like, ridiculously small amount. Physique. Go with Slim, sure, doesn't matter. This game, among all other RPGs, none of this shit really matters, to be honest. Ponytail, yeah, sure, whatever. Sure. Okay, yes, let's get started. I will be quiet during the open cut. In the age of ancients, the world was unformed, shrouded by fog. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. But then there was fire, and with fire came disparity, heat and cold, life and death, and of course, light and dark. Then, from the dark, they came and found the souls of lords within the flame. Nito, the first of the dead. The Witch of Isolith and her Daughters of Chaos. Gwyn, the Lord of Sunlight and his Faithful Knights. And the furtive Pygmy, so easily forgotten. With the strength of lords, they challenged the dragons. Gwyn's mighty lords drew the heart their stone skins. Witches weaved great firestorms. Nito unleashed a miasma of death. will fade, and only dark will remain.
Even now, there are only embers. A man sees not light, but only endless lights. And amongst the living are seen carriers of the accursed dark side. That make total sense? It totally did not. So, just a quick primer on this. Again, I have seen a lot yes, of let's play. Oh, indeed. damn it. The dark sign brands the undead. And in this land. The undead are corralled and led to the north. Where they are locked away to await the end of the world. This is your fate. Alright, so, again, as I was saying, I don't think there's any need for me to introduce the game. Most of you are probably familiar with Dark Souls. It's supposed to be one of the hardest modern games created, etc., etc. Now, again, I have seen a lot of Let's Plays, whatnot. Oh, these are just messages on the ground developers put. Right stick is camera controls. I am going to redo this because I have played on the Xbox a bit. I got up to the gaping... Vagina Dragon, RB is attack. I've obviously figured that much out. Ugh. Don't live here. Jackass. Need your souls. Need all 20 of them. Strong attack. Oh, uh, yeah, RT. So, I, again, I have played. It's been a little while. Oh, there's a uh, big demon. I'm sure we won't see him for a very long time. I'm not going to bother killing so I have watched hours upon hours of this game, but the thing is, one, I usually watch it in bits and pieces, uh, and two, my memory's awful. RS, target lock and release, okay. But again, my memory is terrible. So for the most part, I'm, not, I'm definitely not gonna argue it's blind, because that's not a fair thing to say, because uh, it is absolutely not. But, I, I I don't I still don't understand a lot of things uh, even after watching a lot of of uh, LPs and whatnot. Press the bonfire recover hit points. Yes, I know. But for example, uh, oh, got an achievement tail. Yeah. I uh, I understand how bonfires work and all that, but I still don't understand exactly how to do my stats. I'm not even sure if this was a good class to pick, but it's always what I pick. So there you go. Right now, obviously, we don't have any gear. And I'm trying to commentate for both of you who have watched this. That's not over to the side. Okay, dig. Who have not seen this. Uh, and for those who are obviously familiar with it. And I have no doubt anyone watching this will be like, Oh my god! I can't believe you didn't do this specific thing. And oh, I can't believe you did this and this and blah blah. Oh my god. Where did he come from? Oh, this door just happened to be open. Shortest boss fight ever. So, yeah, I definitely expect that to happen. People to give me their advice. And to some extent, I'm okay with that. Get your shield. Annie, get your gun. Malachi, get your shield. Motherfucker. I wasn't looking. Okay. Oh, 
go into. All right, one thing I always have trouble with is a goddamn inventory, and I really despise how it doesn't say it doesn't pause. You can't pause in this game. That's idiotic, beyond belief. What? Oh, I see what I did. I see. What I did. Again, sorry, it's gonna take me a bit. I gotta get kind of readjust myself. There we go. Block. With this, yep, parry is that. LB with left shift equipped is equipped as guard. Start open menu, yep. Yeah, Alright. So we are gonna run up to this guy with a shield equipped. We're gonna try to dodge though. Like a boss. Hey bitch, what's up? Yeah. Feel this damage, son. Isn't he supposed to run away? I know my weapon is back there. But, uh. Can I? I probably can't even backstab him with this, can I? Probably not. Village of the corpse. Oh my god, you can backstab with the hilt of the sword. That's brilliant. If not nonsensical at the same time not quite sure that would work oh yeah this guy's tough actually I'm just incredibly weak yeah okay I thought he would have been dead by now he's a bad aim all right son come on just there we go uh, this should do it I hope nope uh, strong attack and I'll kick. Oh my god. Please stop on target him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's supposed to have ran away, but he did not. So what are you gonna do? Alright, switch my bandit's knife. And so again, I will probably make quote unquote mistakes with the stat choices that I make. And feel free to mention that kind of stuff in comments. Feel free to give hints. But don't be a dickhole about it, if at all possible. I know that's hard for some people to understand the difference. Uh, but do try your best. Imminent grief. Oh, there's what's his face in there. Back step. Wait, what was that? Oh, just be his back step. Right, okay. Yep. So yeah, again, feel free to give hints. The way I intend to play is... Why does this place look weird? Anyway, the way I intend to play is... I'm not going to try to abuse things too much to trivialize parts of the game. For example, I know all about the Drake Sword. Uh, but I do not intend on... How do I run? Oh, there it is. I do not intend to... Oh, didn't expect that. Ow, I fell on the stairs. So I don't you intend to use a Drake sword. I might load her up. Oh, yeah. Kataka! Oh, repost, bitch! How you like them apples, son? I think this door is locked. Showing up his dog. Hello! And I think this leads us back to the campfire. So, again, advice, great. But don't get pissed if I don't get the Drake Sword, if I, if I, you know, don't, oh, go out of your way and go get this item. I don't really want to do that. I don't want to overpower myself. I, I, I do want to, you know, enjoy the challenge of the game and all that. Hero! Oh, you. You're no hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon, then lose my sanity. I wish to ask something of you. You and I are both undead. Hear me out, will you? Regrettably, I have failed in my mission. But perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my family. Thou who art undead art chosen. In thine exodus from the undead asylum, maketh pilgrimage to the land of ancient lords. When thou ringeth the bell of awakening, the fate of the undead thou shalt know. The longest song saying. And I can die with hope in my heart. Oh, one more thing. 
Here, take this. An Estus flask. An undead favorite. Oh, and this. Now I must bid farewell. I would hate to harm you after death. So go now. And thank you. I know I can kill him. Uh, but I'm, I'm not, because I'm a swell guy. Uh, what does this say? Oh yeah. Bon Rest the bonfire replenishes Estus flask. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, I was, yeah, I was gonna make a joke about the the long ass saying. It's like much harder for kids to remember than. Oh, he died just now. Much harder to remember than winter is coming or we do not sow or hear me roar. Which, by the way, the Lannister saying is "hear me roar," not Lannister paid their debts, as one might think. I think this is closed now. Yes, locked by some contraption. And every time I get stuck right here. So can I, oh, that's right. No, 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 I go up here. Because this key will open this door. I, I also, oh shit, I forgot about that. Hey, calm down, buddy. I also like to try to repost all the time because honestly, that's one of the things that drew me to this game is I like repost parry type systems. Now, that's not to say I'll use it the whole time, nor does it mean that I'm great at it, but I like trying it. Uh, wield right-handed weapon with two hands. Right. Oh, and I do know about the thing where you repost, or you parry, rather, and then you repost with uh, the... You, you switch two-handed weapons. Switch to two hands on one weapon. You know what I'm saying. Go so left stick. That's kick. Okay, and jump attack. Okay. Cool. I'm going to try to explain, for the you guys who have not played Dark Souls, I am going to try to explain as I go. Again, I am not an expert by any stretch of the imagination. Uh, but I do want to try to explain some of the things that are not uh, explained well in the game. Or that I found that other people don't explain all that well. I really don't like the targeting system. Come on. Damn it. Wasn't close enough. Alright, you bitch. Come on. Damn it. Yeah, I sort of reposted there. See, you can block and you can do a repost. Or you can try to parry. All right, wait. So here's just block. So obviously block's pretty self-explanatory. I block with a shield. And at the top left there, you can see my green bar. That's my stamina, I think. If it's not stamina, it's pretty much the same thing. And you can see that when, it, when I block, it drops my stamina. And if I hold my shield up, my stamina also goes uh, higher, slower. And if I attack, my stamina also drops. So a lot of this game is stamina management, at least is what my understanding is. Now you can also parry, which means you hit your parry button and you have to time it just before the attack is going to hit you. And if you parry correctly, that will knock them off and you can do a repost like this. And it does uh, way more damage. Resting bonfire revives enemies. So yeah, anytime you rest at a bonfire, the majority of enemies will come back. You can also backstab, as you saw me do before. You just get behind them, do a light attack, and badoosh! What's this say? Seriously, is a blood stain there? Uh, right button while falling equals plunging attack. Gee, I wonder if I might use that soon. Wow, somebody died right here. All right, so here's how the multiplayer works in this in a nutshell. If somebody dies, they leave a blood stain, like like another real person. You can uh, touch the blood stain and actually watch how they died. You can see this person, this person's like little shadow came up here and then got killed, which is uh, kind of impressive in not a good way. Okay, what is this? Parry, repel an enemy attack, and after parrying, repost. The thing about reposting, parry is the part of the attack or the part of the defensive maneuver, I guess, where you knock their weapon away. Repost is when you actually stab them. And repost to repost, you have to be right up in their grill. So uh, let's try this guy. I'm not very good at reposting these for whatever reason. I was a little slow on that. There we go. And again, lots of damage. The reason, so of course you might say, well, what's the point? Why would I want to repost? Isn't that much more dangerous? The answer is yes, it is, but uh, if you parry and then repost, the repost does a lot of damage, especially if you have a, a piercing weapon. 